Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kathleen and today's video is going to be my Readorama wrap up. So in case you are unfamiliar with Readorama, Readorama is an annual readathon and it's a week long readathon and the readathon was last week which was great because it just happened to fall during my spring break so I had plenty of time to read. I had selected three books to read and unfortunately as much as I tried to get through all three books I only managed managed to read one from my TBR pile and then I started another one from my TBR pile and it wasn't because I was lazy with reading. I was reading one of the books from my TBR pile but then I was listening to the audiobook from another book that I had started reading the previous week but rest assured the other two books that I planned on reading I am actually getting done this month I am so on it with reading this month because so proud of myself so let's go ahead and get started with the books that I did read all right so the one book that I read during Readerama week that was actually in my Readerama TBR was The Empress of a Thousand Skies by Rhoda Beleza and I actually really really enjoyed this book. This is a sci-fi book set in outer space and it is about this girl who's about to turn 16 years old and she is the last living member of this great family dynasty and her parents, her family actually were murdered about 10 years ago when she was just six and she was supposed to die along with them but due to some circumstances she was not there at the time so she ended up surviving and when she turned 16 she is going to be coronated as the next empress on her way to her coronation someone attempts to assassinate her so she runs away again she survives but however no one in the galaxy knows they all believe her to be dead and there's so many other things that go along with it i really really enjoyed this book i thought it was so fun and fast-paced and action-packed. I read some reviews on this book after I finished reading and I was quite surprised at how many people didn't enjoy it. I saw Francine Simone's review on this book and I'll leave a link down below for you guys to check it out. She didn't like the book. She gave it two stars out of five. She had a lot of problems with it and I actually agreed with some of the problems that she had. I kind of understand her thought process and to why she didn't like her, this book but I don't know. For me, I still quite enjoyed this book. I was so into the book, I was so into the plot line, I wanted to know what happens next and I just had a lot of fun reading this and I really am just sad at the fact that this book is a recent release which means the next book will not be out till next year and I have to wait a whole year for the next book and I'm so kind of like pissed off because I cannot I don't want to wait that long for the next book because it was really really good in my opinion. And then the next book that I was supposed to read during Readorama week but I didn't actually get through it. I did start it but I never finished but I wanted, still wanted to talk to you guys about it because it is a book that has been mentioned on my channel for many 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 videos now of for a very long time and it is City of Bones by Cassandra Clare. This is book one on the Mortal Instruments series and you guys know if you have been on my channel for a while how many times I have said I need to read this book and how many times it has been on my TBR videos and I finally picked up this book. I am a, about 180 pages into this book and I'm really really enjoying it. I'm alternating between reading the book and listening to the audiobook while I'm driving to school in my car and I feel like I'm getting a lot of reading done that way by listening to the audiobook as well. And I'm really enjoying this book. I got through like I started on Saturday night which is the day that Reader Rama ended. So I only got about 100 pages uh, into this book. So I can't actually say that I finished this book. I did start it during Reader Rama week though but I didn't finish but I wanted to include it and say to all of you guys who have been waiting for me to start reading this book for a very long long time that I finally picked up this book and I'm really quite enjoying it and the last book that I was supposed to read was Before I Fall by Lauren Oliver. I have read this book a long, long time ago and I wanted to reread it because the movie recently came out and I wanted to go see the movie. But I never ended up picking this book during Read Around Week. But I am planning on reading this month. I really want to read it because I really, really do want to see the movie. Anyway guys, that is my Readerama wrap up. Even though I did read like one and a half books of my Readerama TBR, I feel like I did 
it pretty good because I technically did read two books during this week and I started a third one but one of the books just wasn't in my original TBRs. Anyway, let me know down in the comments below if you participated in read Rama. How did you guys do? Did you manage to read a lot? For me, I feel like I'm really proud of myself because it was spring break and I feel like I did read well. I just didn't really get into the books I was supposed to read. <laughs> anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a like if you did and subscribe to my channel if you're not already. All of my social medias are linked down below including Twitter, Instagram, and Goodreads if you'd like to follow me. I hope to see you guys on my next video. Have a good day guys and keep reading. Bye!